Shy. His ass goes. Yeah, I've seen a few of your ants. Try a different tactic. You push here. Swift and lethal. My path be here. I said slow. I don't know if that's how you're supposed to do that. Well, you're not supposed to de defeat him normally. I might not. Get, if I don't get him this turn, this time, I'm going to just give up. And just go instead for what they want you to do. Assuming that's a good thing with that health. wonder if the gods are watching me. Where did these guys come from? I am fury. I am death. Good. I'm just gonna go make a run for the for the eve. Have someone run for the final layer for the success area. Have someone ready and waiting. Where do I go from here? Not what I meant to do, but whatever. Bastard. Get some, he some healing on him. Kill him.
He keeps saving the pommel against the pommel strike. So that's annoying. Saved by hit him. Come a little closer. I tried, boys. Do the cutscene. The Helm's alien transponder. You made it in time. I've decided to fuck it. <laughs> That's good. Mm. Toasty. The dice were not favoring me on this day. <clears throat> but it is what it is. Hmm. We could just use CUNY instead of those game. CUNY is a little bit better to rotate. Hmm. 
that's a uh, that was those are some low poly models for some reason. Those are types of models. What? What? I have questions. I have a feeling I encountered a glitch. Yep. I think it did. As you wake, the tadpole squirms in your skull. Other than the infection, you're more or less intact. A miracle, given everything you've been through. But it'll all be for nothing if you don't find help soon. The tadpole is a death sentence, and the clock is ticking. You need a cure. Something good here, I hope. Uh, the narrator. It's a D and D game. They need a narrator. Wake up, Shadow. Ain't no time for sleeping. Think of the narrator as the D as the uh, dungeon master. Give me the add artifact. You don't need it. You're sleeping, obviously. What are you doing? I'm alive, yes. Thank you for the concern. She has a shiny thing. I want it. And speaking of, how are we alive? Don't question good things. I remember the ship. I remember falling. <clears throat> then nothing. Do you know what happened to a gift friend? You might want to reconsider calling her a friend. Looks like she ran off without us. No. I don't recognize this place. But anything's an improvement on where we just came from. Fair. First things first. We need supplies, shelter, and most of all, a healer. We might have escaped, but we still have these little monsters in our heads. We need each other. And we both know what's at stake. Can't think of better company. Let's move. One thing, just before we go. I wanted to thank you again for freeing me. It would have been all too easy for you to run right past my pod, but you didn't. There's a weird filter on everything. I remember that. Lead the way. Up. Anything of value in here? Gold. I will be needing money. Um, about that. See, <laughs> I tend to be a murder hobo. Fresh water. There must be a settlement nearby. Pick up the book, I might be able to sell something. I'll take that. You don't need a perfume dead anymore, do you? Uh, duh. Ooh, a loot. Oh, in the invisible bird in my head will like that. More of 
those wretched things. Well, that's just rude. I mean, if you want to get close enough for me to kill you. Better stay back. One step would be lethal. Ooh, level up. Nice. <laughs> In the right story. Bitch, you're not supposed to miss. Make him have. I know. Kill there. You? Nope. Okay. You fight well. There we go. Perhaps our survival isn't such a distant prospect. Uh, I played briefly. I got my first level up. I got an action surge. I'll just stay a fighter for right now. Just stay pure, beat the fuck out of everything. How dare these brains not have any loot for me? How dare they? What's hiding here? Loot. Maybe. Please be a shield. No poison though. I'll take it. Original speed. Him. There is work to do. Got a level hook. Oh fuck, I didn't look at all this stuff. Oh well. Looking ahead. Let's have a look. In what? In the ship? No, but you have to go through it. Eventually. I'm going back because if I remember right, there's a thing over here. And plus more loot to grab. I'll take the fish. Anything of use? Yeah, but right now I don't have access to a shop, so I'm going to try to limit a little bit. Seems simple enough. Okay, that's for fast traveling. 
I sh like, I'm probably already pretty... Like, I'm not very overweighted yet, but that will change very quickly. So, I'm limiting jump. That will, that will have come in handy earlier, but okay. I'll take the water. Got to stay hydrated after all. But I can crack that open. Mm. Got it. Who needs a thief? Ooh, fancy hat. Gives me a plus under my deck for the saving serves. All right, diggity. I th yeah, I've, I've heard about stuff like that. Ooh, what is in here? It's on fire, which means it has to be something good, right? Fire means good things here. Okay, that's just a path into where we were a minute ago. That's not the way I want to go yet. Oh well, yes, it was a giant ship. It was a flying ship. What do you expect? Yeah. A mind flayer. Not dealing with him yet. To be dangerous, even if injured. Just be careful. Please. I have a gay vampire to meet. I've got one of those brain things cornered. I look stupid. In the grass, you can kill it, can't you? Like you killed the others. I was hoping for a kind soul. Well, not to worry. <laughs> ah. Damn it. They weighed the dice. To keep that lovely neck of yours in one piece. Hmm? And you, keep your distance. No need for this to get messy. I need him alive. Yeah, but I have Stop a highest strength uh, uh, modifier. Strength is my highest stat. Promises, promises. But I have other business, I'm afraid. Now, I saw you on the ship. Didn't I? Not. Yes. Time to headbutt this bastard. You son of a. Your mind twists. You're looking out of unfamiliar eyes, prowling dark, busy streets. You try to hold the memory, but it fades to the worm. The light. The fear. <laughs> what was that? What's going on? I'm not an idiot. <laughs> it has to be those tentacled monsters. You seem like one. Something they did. They took you too. I saw it during whatever just happened. And to think, I was ready to decorate the ground with your innards. <laughs> Apologies. 
Mm-hmm. I'm out of wine and flowers, so I hope the introduction. Shadow Horde of disapproves. My name's Astarian. I was in Baldur's Gate when those beasts snatched me. Is that so? We clearly move in different Fuck circles. you too, faint pants. So, do you know anything about these worms? Turn us into... <laughs> yep. <laughs> of course it'll turn me into a monster. What else did I expect? Although, it hasn't happened yet. If we can find an expert, someone that can control these things, there might still be time. You know, I was ready to go this alone, but maybe sticking with the herd isn't such a bad idea. And you seem like a useful person to me. More bodies to throw bombs. Right. I accept. Lead on. Yep. How delicious. Alright, Mr. Vampire, what are you good at? You're a rogue. Here's small animals. Something's on my mind. Really? You approach the dying monster. This is the thing that abducted you. You could end its life here and now. If only you didn't feel compassion. <clears throat> compassion. No, no, no. Yeah. You feel hate, and you deserve to be punished for it. No. You should be whipped, made to bow before this creature in shame. It's possessing your mind, forcing you to love it. No. But then the feeling slips. The creature's mind seems to focus elsewhere. Hmm. I can either break... Let's see, uh, let's see what it's doing. It hides from me. I guess I can't! Fuck me! You try to break through, but its mind is impenetrable. With a last surge of defiance, it slaps your efforts away. 